Pete, that's another three points and, and a clean sheet to boot. What did you make of that game today? Yeah, I thought it was, uh, it was a, always going to be a difficult game, but I thought we'd done uh, both sides of the game really like ugly stuff and, and we played our, our own style and we came out with a three points. So, yeah, great game. Heading into uh, you know Gillingham and Wickham, it's two tough games against two sides that are uh, big and physical and strong and what we've shown over them two games is we're, we're up for that as well. Yeah, 100%. I think the gaffer's made that clear, you know, um, throughout training and stuff that you've got to do both sides. You've got to earn the right to, to play, and I think we've done that. Dominate the ball at Stadium MK then. How enjoyable are them sort of final 30 minutes when Wickham really don't touch the ball and we're just keeping possession? Yeah, yeah, it's wonderful. I think we've got the players for it, you know, that enjoy being on the ball, got the quality to be on the ball and hurt teams. Obviously, today was a, a bit like, you know, you have to keep, keep patient and and wait for that chance to pop up, but um, we've got the win, that's the most important thing. Warren said it after Gillingham that um, when you play teams that play the sort of the way that Wickham and Gillingham do, you've always got to be focused because that ball is always coming and that's the same case today against the likes of Vokes and Akin Fenwa. Yeah, 100%. I think they made a couple of changes as well, like you said, um, and that always, you know, like kind of clicks in your head that you can't switch off for one second. And that was a message being being drilled to us uh, throughout the whole game from the bench. Um, I think we executed that really well. So the way the gaffer works, he probably come in. Well, he will come in on Monday, and not want you to dwell on this with the game on Tuesday. And you as a group, you're probably all the same as, as well. Yeah, hundred percent. I think it's nice to enjoy it. You know, you got to enjoy the moment. Um, you know, straight after the game today, but after that, it's gone. Um, it's a long season. There's a lot of games, and, and you got to focus on the next one. So. As a defender, anything better than a one 0 win then when you keep a clean sheet? Yeah, of course not. Hundred percent. I think you know some of the defending today and even in previous games is, has been a credit to the gaffer and the boys themselves. So, I think when you signed, you said Stadium MK is really suited to your your style of play. It's it's big and it's wide, and I mean you cover a lot of ground down that right. Just how tiring is it playing in Liam Man inside? Yeah, it is, but you get your rewards for it. I think um, you know you always have to to be up and down uh, as a wing back. That's a given. Um, but like I said, it, it allows me to express myself and, and get some joy. So I'm like sure assists are coming soon for you. The strikers narrowly put in some wide. How delighted you could it be when they finally put one home for you? Yeah, I can't wait to be fair. I think um, you just got to keep a level head and, and keep going, keep trying to create them chances. And, and I trust the strikers are going to start putting them. Well, they've been putting them in. It's just for me, they seem like they're not. So yeah, yeah, no, I can't wait. The way this team plays as well, you find yourself, and so does Danny Harvey, in the box an awful lot. And I imagine as a defender, sometimes if you miss a shot, you're frustrated. But the way we play, you're likely to get another one, and that must be a good feeling. Yeah, 100%. I think that's why, you know, myself and others can stay level headed because you know the chances are coming. Like I said, we've got players that create loads of chances for us, and our style of play in general is um, expansive and we get forward. So, yeah, it's just a matter of timing and, and keep going. Whole defence today was, was superb, really, but one man that probably needs singling out is, is Dean Lewington. Just how good is he to play with? Unreal. I think he brings a, a level of calm as well to the team. Um, just, just his presence in, in general. He knows so much. He knows how to, to play, and especially in this style, he gets us ticking. Um, yeah, great to play with him. I think I'm learning a lot just, just observing, really. So. Talk about learning. Just how impressed have you been with the, the start of the coaching staff? Liam, Chris, David and Lewis have all made it. Yeah, yeah, it's been it's been a crazy couple of weeks in terms of like, you know, we've had to face different types of oppositions, learn new things and be adaptable. And I think uh, with the gaffer and the coaching staff, the main thing is, you know, non-negotiable, certain things that you have to have to have there at the core of the team. And I think, you know, we've picked that up really well. It's been a great experience and I think like we're seeing the fruits of um, the hard work. So Finally, we'll touch on, on the fans. Really supportive today, really good noise. Same again Tuesday as I imagine what you as players want. Yeah, hundred percent. Like I said before, like there's no better feeling than playing in front of fans. I think that makes a difference. So yeah, hundred percent. Nice one, Che. Well done. Cheers. Thanks.